What's going on? What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. It is Bob Plays here today. And, uh, you know what we're playing. We're playing some Skyrim. And this little lady, she attacked us. She's like, I have a good reason to believe a target will be coming to Riften in the next few days. Discretion is preferred, but elimination of the target is the highest priority. The usual restrictions on exposure, blah, 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 E. So we know that's Esmond, or whatever his name is. We're not looking to kill that mofo. Not today. Um... What was this? Okay. So that was the note from last episode, if you guys haven't seen that yet. Um, we're not going to go look for Espen. Unless we stumble across him. I mean, maybe. But our main priority is to... Is to, you know, meet... Carlia, or whatever her damn name is. I mean, but whatever happens, happens. You know, I'm not, I'm not, you know, crazy about what's gonna happen. You know, because you know anything could happen. You know how this, you know how it works, man. Anything could happen. Anything is possible when you're playing Skyrim. Anything at all. And well, there she is, man. Looks like we're doing this. I'm glad you're here. I think some of these people are beginning to suspect who I am. Are you ready to face the guild? I'm ready, let's go. Keep your eyes open. I'm not sure what to expect when we enter the system. What up, boys and girls? What is this? Uh, 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 uh. She knows exactly where she's going to. Out the way, girl. The ragged flogging. The ragged flogging. Ah. The ragged flogging. You better have a damn good reason to be here with that murderer. Please, lower your weapon so we can speak. I have proof that you've all been misled. No tricks, Carlia, or I'll cut you down where you stand. Now what's this so-called proof you speak of? I have Gallus's journal. I think you'll find its contents disturbing. Let me see. No, it can't be. This can't be true. I've known Mercer too long. It's true, Brynjolf. Every word. Mercer's been stealing from the guild for years. Right under your noses. There's only one way to find out if what the last says is true. Delvin, I'll need you to open the vault. Wait just a blessed moment, Brynjolf. What's in that book? What did he say? It says Mercer's been stealing from a vault for years. Gallus was looking into it before he was murdered. Bag of Mercer up now before he needs two keys. It's impossible. Could he pick his way in? It's one of the best puzzle locks money can buy. There's no way it can be picked open. He didn't need to pick it up. Or shield it there. Use your key on the vault, Delvin. We'll open it up and find out the truth. Use my key, but the vault's still locked up tighter than a drum. Now use yours. Freaking Mercer. Give the guy some freaking room. Get in here, all of you. Well, what do you know? Mercer, the little bloody bastard. It's yours. It's all gone. That son of a bitch. I'll kill him. Bex, put it away. Right now. 
We can't afford to lose our heads. We need to calm down and focus. Do what he says, Vex. This ain't helping right now. Fine. We do it your way. For now. Delta, Vex, watch the flagon. If you see Mercer, come tell me right away. You still have quite a good bit of jobs available. If you don't be the slowest recording. Before I help you track Mercer down, I need to know what you learned from Carlia. I mean, everything. I... I feared that was the case. From that last entry in Gallus' diary, it looks like he was getting close to exposing Mercer to the guild. Anything else? Ah. Trying to make Mercer look bad in front of Maven, eh? Clever lass. Was there anything else? What? Nightingales? But I always assumed they were just a tail. A way to keep the young footpads in line. Was there anything else she told you? Then I have an important task for you. I need you to break into Mercer's home and search for anything that could tell us where he's gone. Aye. A gift from the Black Briars after they kicked the previous family out. A place called Rift Wheeled Manor. He never stays there. Just pays for the upkeep on it. Hired some lout by the name of Bold to guard the place. I'll take care of it. You know me. Be careful, lad. This is the last place in Skyrim I'd ever want to send you. Just find a way in, get the information, and leave. And you have permission to kill anyone that stands in your way. Okay, what's missing from the vault? The question would be, what did he leave? Mercer took everything. Even all of our plans are gone. What? Plans for what? Before Mercer took over, Gallus started collecting every bit of material he could on locations the guild could heist. Museums, keeps, estates, you name it. By the time Mercer took over the guild, we must have had a few dozen. I don't have a clue. That door is impenetrable. Without two keys, it's impossible to open. I have a key, Delvin has a key, and Mercer has a key. That's it. There are no other copies. Huh. What's the best way? Good question. I've only set foot inside a few times myself, and that was in Mercer's company. If you can get past his trained watchdog, I think your best bet might be the ramp to the second floor balcony in his backyard. No. It's some sort of crazy contraption Mercer commissioned for quick escapes. I'd wager a well-placed shot at the ramp's mechanism would lure it in a hurry. Yeah, I bet I know your guy. He's hiding out in the Ratway Warrens, paying us good coin for nobody to know about him. Huh, that'd be bald. A real piece of work, that one. Hmm. Mercer's holding something over his head, keeping him loyal. Talk to Vex. She used to know him very well, if you catch my meaning. Okay. Careful at Mercer's place. I don't want to lose anyone else to that madman. Freaking A, move out of the way. Okay, so. Who the hell can I speak with? Can't believe we emptied the ball right from under our noses. <sighs> Bloody bastard, huh? Freaking Mercer, the little a hole. Okay, not a problem. 
Can't even get a novice freaking lock. Are you serious, boys? Come on, man. I can't even get a novice lock. God. There we go, boys. Vlad, you ugly guy. Hey. Oh, that's a message to Masa. That's a message to Masa, the freaking bloody bastard. Man. Why so many damn locks, dude? It's like Mercer is hiding something or some shit. Okay, so. Okay. Damn. This is the hardest expert I've ever done. Okay, fuck that, dude. Boom. See, it just takes a little luck, man. That's all it takes. Oh, you've got to be shitting me, dog. Okay. What up, son? Oh, look at them freaking guns. I called him. I called him gay. Hey, don't worry, man. Must be my imagination. Is someone there? What up, son? What up? Oh, 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 oh. Dude, I'm gonna steal everything in Mercer's, dude. Bl guy's a bloody thief, man. Oh, of course. Ow, oh, damn it. Ow, oh, that hurt. Not gonna lie, that kinda burned a little bit. Damn, he doesn't want anyone stealing anything, does he? Okay. Oh, the red kitchen reader.
I already read it, son. Okay. Oh. Man, I'm taking all that shit. Okay. Magic in this chill room, boys. Ah, dang it. What up? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh. 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 Okay, so. Level 40, huh? What do we got for light armor then? I'm not much of a dual person though, so. You know. You know, I guess we could take that. Uh huh. Oh yeah, look at that. You call them freaking gains. Okay, so I'm gonna try to actually unlock this though. Damn it. Damn it. Damn. Damn. God, what the hell? You've got to be shitting me. I'm literally inches away. There we go, boys. Oh. Close that display. All right. And they're at way vault. Okay, I can't see a damn thing. Is someone there? There's the place. You can't hide. Want me, can't that want me? Whoa! Want me, can't that want me? Whoa! I won't fight. Come on. Dang. That should be worth a fortune. If I see Frey, I'll pluck his eyes from his skull with my bare hands. Can't talk long. Gotta keep my eyes open for Bursa. This is getting dangerous. Don't let anything stay focused in case Frey comes back. Make it fast. How dare you? After all we've been through together? That pig. Oh, I have info on him. More than you care to know. 
Vald, good side? I think you have the wrong person. The only thing Vald understands is gold. A man after my own heart. Sure, but he'll ask for a whole lot. I mean, you are asking him to betray Mercer Frey. Your best bet would be to erase his debt with Maven Blackbriar. If you talk to her, she might be able to give you the details. Of course, you could just run him through and take what you need off his corpse. I could care less. While you're in there, help yourself to anything in Frey's manner. Well, looks like you're fitting in well down here. I'm supposed to allow you to trade in one of your pieces of guild armor. So what will it be? Of course. Otherwise it wouldn't be much of a reward, now would it? Duh. Your new piece will enhance your skill beyond that of the original. Trust me. If you find Merce, of course. Otherwise it wouldn't be much of a reward, now would it? Your new piece will enhance your skill beyond that of the original. Trust me. Are you sure? Once I exchange it for you, I'm not taking it back. Unless you want to sell it at a discount, of course. Okay, there you go. A pearl. There's no doubt, Mercer. I give special rates to members of the Thieves Guild. Show me what you've got. Alright, I'll show you what I got, baby. I got all kinds of stuff. I got... Give me this. i say that. Say that. 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 Oh. I'll probably keep those. Flawless. Alright, let me get rid of some apparel that I don't need. I don't need this shit. I don't need this. Don't need that. I don't need that ugly thing. I don't need that ugly thing. Um, man, you know. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I need some more lock picks. Okay, now let me get some more of this. Right. If you find Mercer, give no quarter. Kill him and be done with it. Okay, dang. Speak to Bruno. Keep my eyes open for Mercer. For Mercer, gotta keep my eyes open for Mercer. What up, boys and girls? <sighs> We've scoured the town and I've spoken to every contact we have left. Shore's beard. He's going after the eyes of the Falmer? That was Gallus' pet project. If he gets his hands on them, you can be certain he'll be gone for good and set up for life. Agreed. He's taken everything the Guild has left, and to go after one of the last greatest heists is just an insult. I've spoken to Carlia and made amends for how the Guild's treated her. Now she wishes to speak with both of us. Quickly. We have no time to lose. Until next we meet live. Alright, Dad. Huh? said it was important. I promise you, all your questions will be... Brynjolf, the time has come to decide Mercer's fate. 
Until a new Guildmaster is chosen. So, the decision of falls to you. I last, but I've come to a decision. Mercifully, tried to kill both. He betrayed the guild, murdered Gallus, and made us well, question our future. Here, he needs to die. If I wanted to hear a tall tale, I'd read a children's story. Mercer is Get a mighty some better story, an agent of Nocturnal. And it's all true. Everything I heard in the stories. The Nightingales, their allegiance to Nocturnal, and the Twilight Sepulchre. That's why we need to prepare ourselves and meet Mercer on equal footing. Just outside the rift, beyond the southeast gate is a small path cut up the mountainside. At the so end of that path is a clear and an old standing yeah. stone. What up? I'd ask you both to meet me there. So, is it true bandits get, you know, real? I have some preparations of my own to make. <laughs> I'll meet you at the stone. You're in your All right. Okay, so what the freak are we doing? Not so loud. Oh, I thought I... An apothecary in town, yeah. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> hey, I'm the brewmaster around way. here. Who what you did you want? Welcome. Allow me to recommend the Black Friar Me, the purest brew in all of Skyrim. What the? What the hell? What is that? Well, that's not even, that was wordless. Again, what is it this time? Well, you got Maven. She pretty much runs the whole operation. She's got friends in high places, if you know what I mean. She's also got ties to the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves Guild. So basically, no one can touch her. Just remember, if she tells you to do something, you damn well better do exactly what she says. Oh. Slip up and I'll gut you. Okay, uh, clearly you're a little bitch. No, you can't. Keep on forgetting I don't have that sprint on me. I swear to God, I hope it's not far. It's far, I swear to God, I'm gonna get pissed. Oh my God, I thought it froze. Oh my God, oh what? I'm glad you're here. Okay, what significance of this place? Huh? This is the headquarters of the Nightingales, cut into the mountainside by the first of our kind. We've come to seek the edge we need to defeat Mercer Frey. If you'll follow me, I'll try to explain on the way. 
All right. This way, please. Oh, boys and girls, I think I know what's happening. I think we're going to become a nightingale, son. We're going to be a freaking beast. So this is nightingale hall. I heard about this place when I joined it, but I never believed it existed. The assumption that the nightingales were just a nightingale. Oh, yeah. Yeah, bring you off. Hey, man. Why are you walking so low? We can begin the earth. This is enough to make your head spin, eh? Activate the armor stone, huh? I guess I could do that shit. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Oh, what up? Oh. Boys and girls, look at that. What up, boys? Time's wasting, and Mercer's still out there. Let's get this show on the road. You look there ready for the earth. Look at that. Nightingale, boys. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, guys. Sorry. Do do do. I think. Okay, lass. We've got these get ups on. Now what? Beyond this gate is the first step in becoming a nightingale. Whoa there, lass. I appreciate the armor, but becoming a nightingale? That was never discussed. To hold any hope of defeating Mercer, we must have Nocturnal at our backs. If she's to accept you as one of her own, an arrangement must be struck. What sort of arrangement? I need to know the terms. The terms are quite simple, Brindle. Nocturnal will allow you to become a nightingale and use your abilities for whatever you wish. And in return, both in life and in death, you must serve as a guardian of the Twilight Sepulchre. Aye, there's always a catch. But at this point, I suppose there isn't much to lose. If it means the end of Mercer Frey, you can count me in. What about you? Are you ready to transact the oath with Nocturnal? Good. I'm ready. After I open the gate, please stand on the western circle. I think we should trust the lass and take the deal. Okay, you Ireland fuck. You Irish fuck. I think we should trust, we should trust the lass. The, and take the, deal. the end of Mercer Most Frey. Of Oh, you have to pull it? We'll speak when the oath is complete. I think we should trust the lass and take the deal. Alright. Uh. Oh god. Oh god. Freaking light is just here. Still here. I'll head back home if you need me. Honored to see you again, my thing. I am your sword and your shield. I 
I call evil. upon you, Lady Nocturnal, Queen of Mirth, and Empress of Shadow. Hear my voice. Ah, Carlia. I was wondering when I'd hear from you again. Lose something, did we? My lady, I've come before you to throw myself upon your mercy and to accept responsibility for my fate. You're already mine, Carlia. Your terms were struck long ago. What could you possibly offer me now? I have two others that wish to transact the oath. To serve you both in life and in death. You surprise me, Caroline. This offer is definitely weighted in my favor. My appetite for Mercer's demise exceeds my craving for wealth, Your Grace. Revenge. How interesting. Very well. The conditions are acceptable. You may proceed. Lady Nocturne, we accept your terms. We dedicate ourselves to you as both your avengers and your sentinels. We will honor our agreement in this life and the next until your conditions have been met. Very well. I name your initiates Nightingale. And I restore your status to the same, Carlyle. And in the future, I'd suggest you refrain from disappointing me again. Oh, wow. That was pretty cool, huh? So... Now that you've transacted the oath, it's time to reveal the final piece of the puzzle to you. Mercer's true crime. Mercer was able to unlock the guild's vault without two keys because of what he stole from the Twilight Sepulchre, the skeleton key. By doing this, he's compromised our ties to Nocturnal, and in essence, caused our luck to run dry. So the key unlocks? Yes, but the key isn't only restricted to physical barriers. All of us possess untapped abilities, the potential to wield great power securely sealed within our minds. Once you realize the key can access these traits, potential becomes limitless. Good. Then you understand why this is about more than just Mercer's lust for power. If the key isn't returned to its lock in the Twilight Sepulchre, things will never be the same for the guild. As time passed, our luck would diminish to the point of non-existence. And whether you know it or not, our uncanny luck defines our trade. Very huh. true. In our line of work, it's quite rare we set out to return a stolen item to its rightful owner. Before we depart, Brynjolf has some business to discuss. I suggest you listen to him. Listen, lad. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go. Listen, lad. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go after Mercer. The leadership of the guild. Carlia and I had a long discussion before you arrived here. Thanks to your efforts, Mercer's treachery has been exposed. After we deal with him, all that remains is restoring the guild to its full strength. As a result, we both feel that you have the potential of replacing Mercer as leader of the Thieves' Guild. Me? What the hell about you, bro? I've been at this game a long time, my friend. A long time. I've stolen trinkets from nobles and framed priests for murder. I'm good at what I do. Maybe even one of the best. But it's all I know. I've never been one to lead. Never desired it. Never cared for it. Don't want it. I don't know what to say. Well, we have a bit of an errand to run before your coronation. So don't get sentimental on it. <laughs> I accept. Then it's decided. When this is all over and Delvin's contacts assure me that we've regained our footing in Skyrim, we'll handle the details. Until then, we have quite the task ahead. Let's get it! I've been pouring over the plans you brought us, and I'm convinced the eyes of the Falma are in the Dwarven ruins at Urkenthal. Carlia and I will meet you there. Prepare yourself, lad. This will be a fight to remember.
Aye. And some of what Carlyas said is starting to make sense. Mercer may have damaged our reputation and raided our coffers. This goes well beyond even his twisted form of larceny. Old Delvin kept calling it a curse, and we all laughed at him. Looks like the joke's on us. Sorry, lad. We've got important things to do. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Where the hell are we going now? Where the hell are we going now? Um... Okay. That's what's up, boys and girls. What the? Okay. Do you really want to try to kill me? Hard the. I wonder what your note says. Oh, you don't have a note. What a waste of my damn time. So I guess I gotta cross this to get up there, maybe? Hell, I don't know. We're just gonna try to do it. Or what? I don't got time. There we go. Boom! Look at that shit! That guy just lost his head. Literally. He literally lost his head during the situation. That was crazy, mates. Oh god, I hope I'm going the right way. It looks like the right way, but I mean, I have no idea. Oh my god, I hit my damn mic. Oh my god, I'm sorry guys, I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how to get across here without dying. What the hell is that? Must be the giants, huh? God dang it. Well, guys. It's been a good run. But now I gotta come down. Hopefully I don't have to go down there. 
Hopefully it doesn't have to resort to that. But if it does, guys, I guess it does. I really hope it doesn't, though. Okay. Here we go, boys. Whoa! <laughs> okay, we're dead. Bakum is dead. Story's over. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. God, we gotta make it. We gotta make it there before that this episode ends, man. I know we gotta do it. We gotta do it, maybe. At least make it there. Okay. Okay, so maybe that'll be the best way. But, guys. Oh, man, I hate to tell you guys, but I mean, I, we're pushing close to time, and I know it's going to be a long battle with Mercer, so thank you guys so much for stopping by, man. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. If you guys love this series, you like it just a little bit, hit that like button. Go ahead, hit that like button. Go ahead. Go ahead. I dare you. I dare you. I triple dog dare you. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to see more Skyrim videos in the future next episode we will be facing mercer we will be taking that guy apart killing that mofo with everything we have so i don't know if it's enough but we're gonna try so yeah <laughs> all right guys i will see you next time peace